Hello, and welcome to, JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will see what is aquaplaning, and why is it dangerous for aircraft, and automobiles. What is aquaplaning? Aquaplaning occurs when a layer of water, builds between the road, or runway, and the wheels of an aircraft, or an automobile. The wheels will lose contact with the surface, which will lead to loss of traction, and loss of control, of the moving vehicle. What causes aquaplaning? Aquaplaning occurs when there is standing water, on the surface. It also depends on the speed of the vehicle. When the vehicle is moving at low speeds, the tire will disperse the water, and stay in contact with the surface. As the speed of the vehicle increases, a wedge of water starts to form, ahead of the wheels. The water starts accumulating, ahead of the tires. If the tire is able to disperse the water, then vehicle stays in contact, with the surface. The ability to disperse the water, depends on the design, and the size, of the tires. If the speed of the vehicle increases further, the wedge of water becomes stronger, and creates an upward force, on the wheel. This upward force, causes the wheel to lift up, and a layer of water, comes in between the wheel, and the surface. So the wheel loses contact, with the surface. This is called as aquaplaning, which can lead to loss of traction, and control, of the vehicle. Types of aquaplaning Dynamic aquaplaning This depends on the tire pressure, and ground speed, of the moving vehicle. Viscous aquaplaning. This occurs because of water accumulation on smooth surfaces, and contaminants on the surface. It may occur at any speed. Reverted rubber aquaplaning. This occurs because of a locked wheel, and the heat it generates, causing the surface moisture to boil. The moisture creates a gap between the wheel, and the surface. This is the only type of aquaplaning, that leaves a mark, on the road, or runway. Avoiding aquaplaning. For aircraft, pilots will not land if there is standing water on the runway and water depth of more than 3 millimeters. Try to land on a different runway. Use max thrust reversers and the ground spoilers. For automobiles, reduce speed by releasing the accelerator. Press the brakes gently to decrease the speed further. The tire pressure, condition of the tires, and the speed of the vehicle plays a major role on aquaplaning. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please subscribe.